All right, today we're gonna create a couple of simple sentences using our C star circle map. So here is the circle map and in the center I have C stars. This is what we're talking about. And then everything around the outside of it are things that C stars have or can. So we have C stars can be many colors. C stars can be called starfish. I'm not sure how to draw that, but they're actually not fish. So that's why we do know them as starfish, but they're not a fish, which is why we call them sea stars, stars of the sea. And then sea stars can regenerate a ray. Sea stars have no brain. Sea stars have no blood. Sea stars have two stomachs. Sea stars have bumpy skin, tube feet, an eye spot arms called rays. All right, so from yesterday's writing, we had sea stars can be, and then my color was orange. I also colored in the rock and I added another um, sea star on the rock with that one. So let's get started. Remember, this is a simple one. This is easy just by copying off of the circle map. So we're gonna keep our word the same of sea stars. It might sound repetitious, but it, we're trying to make it as easy as possible for them. So they don't even have to sound these words out. They're just copying it down. So just like yesterday, the same thing. I ended well. I'm gonna come over here and start again. Same thing, uppercase S, lowercase E, lowercase A. And they can almost look straight above, can't they? Stars, because we're writing what we're talking about. We're talking about sea stars, sea stars. And I'm gonna just, I'm looking at it. I'm like, yeah, well, we already said it was orange. So I don't wanna say they can be many colors. We're gonna go ahead and do sea stars have, and then let's do mm, tube feet. So C stars have H, A, V, E. C star, who do you It's like a tongue twister. C stars have, we're gonna write tube feet. They can copy it down straight from the circle map. You don't have to sound it out for them. They can look and go, I wanna write that word and they just copy it down. So I know some of you say, well, my child can't even sound the words out. Well, then just let them copy it. That's why the pictures are here. So they can go, I want to write that word. It's kind of like write the room. Sea stars have tube. And the most important part when we're writing, make sure we're writing nicely in that line confinement. That's the last skill I feel in kindergarten for them to master. So even really good writers, they still have difficulties with the line confinement, squishing their letters, making sure they're tall in between the lines. They like to write really large and spread their letters out. Finger space, and then we're gonna do feet. Another thing with, I was looking at feet. Whoops, I'm on a bump on my table. <laughs> Whoops. Um, another, and I'll put my period to stop my sentence. Another thing when I was looking at feet, if they are sounding it out, um, and they might say E and then a T and only have one E. You don't have to spell it for them. You can tell them that's correct. They will eventually, it's almost like they are detectives. You can tell them that. You're a detective. You're a writing detective. You'll figure out rules with writing and spelling of how to spell it correctly in first grade. Um, some know that E the double E, but there's rules for them and they'll figure it out. We just don't want to constantly spell for them or they're not gonna wanna try and spell on their own. All right, so you could stop at this. If this is, we did this sentence yesterday and then we just created this sentence today and stop. Um, some parents say, it takes forever for them to finally get one sentence. Then I say, take a break, come back and say, I wanna write, let's write one more fact about sea stars and then we're done. So it's okay to take a break and walk away and then come back and have them write one more. The goal is to get three sentences. If you only get, this was yesterday, remember, we're not sitting writing all three at one time. Yesterday, today, and if you have their attention and they're able to write one more fact, go ahead. 
if they're wanting to move or you notice they start getting really sloppy, that tells you you need to stop. Don't just sit and tell them, you know, start writing slower, write nicer. That means stop because I've seen where the finger spacing looks great and then all of a sudden the next line, it's like, bah, that means they were done. So just stop, walk away, take a break, get a snack, come back and then focus to get one more good sentence out of them. So it's okay to take a break. All right, I'm gonna do one more. We're gonna keep it the same again with C stars. I want just to show you how easy this is. Copying down C stars again. So we have C stars can be orange. C stars have tube beat. Do C stars one more time. Uppercase S, it starts our sen sentence starter here. And look at, they all line up nicely. That's never the case with writing. <laughs> Okay, C stars, and we're still doing have, so I'm lining it straight up again. And have is a sight word. Okay, and then I wanted to say hmm, two stomachs. You can write the word two, but it's okay just to write the number. It's right there. So we're gonna do a finger space, and I'm just gonna write the number two. I'm gonna make sure I stretch it all the way to the top and the bottom, it's nice and big, two. And then I need to do a finger space and I'm gonna write stomachs. Remember, you don't have to sound it out if it's right there for you. You can, but you don't have to. So they can look right over there and write. Oh, I gotta get my. And then if you notice, oh gosh, I'm getting close to the end. So just remind them. Okay, you're almost to the end, so make sure your letters are not too big. It doesn't mean make them shorter, it just means make them skinnier. Because sometimes that happens and we don't want them, what we don't want them to do is start writing down like this. You run out of room, it's like, ah, oh, barely Miss Aldridge. All right, so now let's read. C stars can be orange. C stars have tube feet. C stars have two stomachs. Done.